Merry Christmas everyone Da 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 What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> Yo guys, how are you all doing? Matty here, welcome back to another brand new video here on the channel and it is Christmas, Merry Christmas to all of you uh, every single one of you who are watching right now whether you're watching this on Christmas Day when it comes out on Boxing Day or whether it's after, I hope you're all having or you've all had an amazing day with your friends and your family. As you can tell by the title and the thumbnail, today we are doing What I Got For Christmas 2021. Now I did say to myself last year that I was going to do this video right when I was around starting to actually do YouTube videos instead of just gaming clips and stuff, um, but I completely forgot about it like completely forgot about it so that that one never materialized so i've been saying to myself every like when i keep thinking about it since last year that i was gonna do it this year so here it is this is what i got for christmas 2021 uh if you do like the video make sure you hit that like button it helps it helps push the video uh way up the algorithm it helps introduce the channel to new audiences which is what we need, we want to grow, that's what we want to do, that's why we're doing it. We'd like to grow to as many people as possible. Um, so if you could hit the like button and push the video right up the algorithm so it's possibly seen by more people. And if you haven't already, please, please hit that subscribe button, I would really appreciate it. We are currently on 90 subscribers at time of recording. And we've got, what, a week until the end of 2021 and I really want to get to 100 subscribers by then. So if you could help me out and hit the subscribe button, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. Right, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we have quite a lot to get through. There is quite a lot in that sack. There's quite a lot of piles of stuff and, you know, this, that and the other. So I think we better start straight away because I don't want this video to go on too long. Uh, so yeah, let's get into it. What I got for Christmas this year. So I think we're going to start with the clothes because I think that's what we've got the most of so I'll get them all out the way and then I'll just get into the other things that I have after that so yeah right let's start then <laughs> right so right socks pretty standard <laughs> Merry Christmas and um, so yeah some socks you know it's what everyone needs at the end of the day so this white under armor t-shirt it's, it's quite nice I do like me under armor stuff it's quite good for the gym be quite a good one for the gym. I don't go to the gym, but I'm planning on going to the gym. So it'll be good, good wear for that. Good, what's the word? Good, good. Nah, yeah, it doesn't matter. Moving on. This Under Armour, I think this was a tracksuit. I'm not sure. But it, this is quite nice, actually. It's like a tracksuit top, grey and black. It's got a beautiful white trim going down the arm, which I like. Um, so I don't know if I got this as a whole tracksuit or not. If I did, it'll probably come up later on. But... You know, everything's just so muddled up because I've just all brought it upstairs just for this video that it's probably, you know, going to be, you know, every, muddled up everywhere. Uh, next, these Under Armour bottoms. I don't know if these are the bottoms for that, but it's bottoms nonetheless because I've been running out of tracksuits recently because they've all been getting too small or they've all been getting holes in them. So, uh, thank God I've got, you know, more of them now so I have more choice and stuff, so... Next, we have these two beautiful Hugo Boss t-shirts, size small, because I am only 5 foot 6. <laughs> we also got this sort of like khaki green Hugo Boss, sort of like, it's like a silky t-shirt, like sil silky material, which is like the type of material I like. So, yeah, I, I like my khaki green, that sort of murky green colour. I just think it suits me quite well. And, well, here we go as well. Got a lovely Under Armour tracksuit in that colour as well. Uh, it's kind of black and khaki green, which are the colours that I like. As I said, it just so happens to suit me, so why not get it? And it's also a really nice colour. There's the tracksuit top. Uh, we also got this, another colour that suits me quite well. Burgundy, a Luke, oh shit, Luke sort of jumper for like going out and stuff. Uh, I like Burgundy, I think it also suits me really well. Luke as well, a very underrated brand. It's a very... Very good brand, great, great quality product. I just want to point out that we are not sponsored by Luke or any of these brands, by the way. Who am I kidding? I've fucking got 90 subscribers. Who the fuck's going to sponsor me? We've also got even more tracksuits from Under Armour. Stop fucking falling. 
We've got, <laughs> we've got Under Armour tracksuit. This one's grey and black. I'm trying to get through this like as quickly as possible because I don't want the video to go over like 20 minutes. So I'm trying to keep it all, you know, thingy. When I edit it, I'll obviously trim things down. But, you know, there's the tracksuit bottoms for that. Um, another Under Armour silky t-shirt. Uh, I do have a lot of Under Armour, but I just like it. Uh, the t-shirt that goes with that burgundy Luke jumper that I've just said to you guys. Another Under Armour t-shirt. Well, not t-shirt, tracksuit. There we go. That one's just plain black and white. And also this North Face coat as well. If I can get the thing. This North Face coat. It's not like a big coat. It's sort of like a, you know, just like a light jacket. Uh, but, you know, I do need one. My other one is getting a bit small now, so... At least I've got a backup one now to fall back on. One of my favourite things I got this year was these pair of Nike Air Force Ones. There you are. Get them out of the box so you can have a closer look. There they are. Very, 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 very sexy. Uh, so there they are. Uh, I did not get Air Forces just so I could grow my height by about two inches. So don't comment that, please. Uh, But yeah, I do like Air Forces, they are quite nice shoes, and they do give me a bit of height, so, you know, I don't like being as small, I find that I am a lot smaller than the large majority of people at college. I've got this uh, Jim King uh, tracksuit, which I'm wearing now, which has a nice little Jim King detailing on here, and on the bottom of the ankle as well. I also got a nice white uh, Jim King t-shirt, which I'm wearing under here now. Um, which is all good. I like Jim King. I like the quality of the clothing and stuff. Um, but yeah, there is, believe it or not, there is, believe it or not, there is more stuff. <laughs> so next up, we've got this big sack. So uh, let's have a delve inside. Ugh. What's in here? So I think I'm just going to pick these out one by one. This is like a wash bag full of Lynx stuff. I mean, you are not a British teenage boy if you don't get Lynx for Christmas at some point. Um, we've also got uh, some uh, garments, to say the least. <laughs> and, yeah, some more tracksuits, because as you can probably tell, I am a bit of a chav. I'm not really, I just like tracksuits. But we've got this one, which is Jack and Jones, I believe. Yeah, Jack and Jones, lovely, like, squiggly font down the side. Need to be ironed, it's a bit creased. But uh, yeah, we've got that, and then the matching hoodie. It's a very nice, very nice tracksuit. I do like that a lot. Jack and Jones is not a brand that I've worn before, really, but, you know, uh, I like the quality of that. I tried it on, and it's quite slim fitting as well, which is what I like. Uh, next up, we've got this, another one of my favourite things that I got. Stone Island uh, tracksuit top jumper thing. Uh, which I shall wear to the Borough Match with Pride tomorrow because I am a hooligan. I'm not really. But uh, I'll be wearing that to the Borough Match with Pride tomorrow up the Borough well, against Nottingham Forest tomorrow. So, yeah, that should be a good day tomorrow. Talking of Borough, we've got the official Borough Annual, which is what I got every year. I get it every year and then try and get it signed by as many players as possible so I can keep them as mementos. Um, we've also got this, Paco Raban. Uh, Paco Ruban, I don't know how you pronounce it, like sort of like gift set. So it's the Invictus one, which is beautiful, I love Invictus. It's got the aftershave, a little mini aftershave bottle and the shower gel in there. It's very nice, very nice metal tin as well. Very nice metal tin it comes in, so I'll put that down there. See what else we've got. We've got this, I do like this. Lyle and Scott, grey and white jumper. Again, something that I think I'll wear at the gym when I start going. Uh, beautiful, beautiful garment. And then also this Middlesbrough FC polo shirt, which is an alternative for match days, I guess. Season ticket holder, you've got to change up the club every once in a while. Oh, and that concludes what's in the sack. That is pretty much all the clothes and stuff finished now. Uh, well, there's a few, a few left, but, you know, we're virtually done. We've got these uh, Jeff Banks uh, hat and glove set, which comes in very handy for winter matches, night matches at the Borough, and also if I'm going out with mates on a night, and it's quite cold. So this Nivea Men set, which has shower gel and uh, man cream in it. Uh, don't take that out of context, please. 
um, man cream in it, which is just like for your face, like a moisturiser. A nice Timberland silky material t-shirt. Again, they all come in very handy, so it's good to have them. A very large L'Oreal men's set, which includes shower gel, a roll-on deodorant, a face wash. I need that because my spots do come out a lot, especially the amount of chocolate I'm going to be eating over Christmas. And then the moisturiser, which you use after the face wash. So that is good and hopefully should sort, sort my skin out a bit. I'm very sensitive about my skin. I don't like my spots and stuff. But anyway, moving on. That's probably a separate video if you want to see that. But, you know... Uh, Jack Will's gift set, uh, which has a scarf in it, again, hat, it comes in handy in winter, and a nice body spray as well, I do like my body sprays. So, oh, there's only a few items to go now, I didn't even realise. I'm going to get on to the novelty items now, uh, or like the things that like came alongside uh, all the clothes and stuff that I got. Uh, we're going to... We're going to start off with this bag of stuff uh, from my nana. God bless her. I love her so much. Uh, if you see this nana, I love you. Thank you so much. Uh, she probably won't bless her. But, you know, I thought, thought she might because she's seen them before. Uh, so, off nana, we've got this Dove Men Care tin set, uh, which basically just includes deodorant and face wash and stuff. But I've already got a lot of them and that almost fell out. So, going well. We also got a lovely card as well off Nana. A £50 JD Sports gift card. Who knows? Maybe could be doing a giveaway soon. You never know. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. We also got some a more hat and glove set uh, that was there as well. As usual, filled with chocolate wrappers because I am one greedy bastard on Christmas. I will eat so much chocolate. I mean, I, I didn't have the bag of celebration she gave me for more than two minutes before I opened them and started eating them. So that just tells you how much chocolate I like. Some more toiletry and sanitary items. We've got this Gillette shaving kit, which comes with the, uh, the razor, the Gillette Fusion 5. And also, if I'm not mistaken... Yeah, comes with a little box as well to put all your shaving stuff in, which is not bad at all. Uh, so, yeah, because my beard does grow back quite quick and my moustache and everything, so, you know, it might be useful to use that in the future. Michael Jackson's Invincible album, which, you know, I love. Love Michael Jackson, huge Michael Jackson fan. Uh, and Invincible's one of the only albums I haven't got of his yet, so I'm glad to have that. I'll give that a listen later on tonight absolute legend and next this the boss bottled gift set we'll see what's in it see what, if i can open the bastard thing fuck i know yeah so you basically just get shower gel and a bottle of the boss after shave pretty cushy if you ask me we also got not one but two onesies uh because you know sometimes we just like to chill on a night uh, in the onesie just watch tiktok or youtube or something and just you know, not do anything, because sometimes that's the best thing that we can do. Uh, some of the things that I got, which are over there, but I'm just going to end the video now, because I feel as though it's going on a little bit too long, and you might be getting a bit bored now. I've got a new calendar for next year. I've got a Borough one, but I've got a, a WWE one this year uh, for next year, which is, you know, you may think it's a bit childish, but, you know, a calendar's a calendar, and I do forget things, so I need one. Uh, we also just got a lot of chocolate, but you don't need to see chocolate, you already know what chocolate looks like, so, you know, there's not really much for anything. And last but not least, we got this, we obviously got some money from the cards and stuff that we got, um, so, yeah, there's about 120 quid there at the moment. All of that is going to be going towards um, my gaming PC setup and everything. Uh, I'm going to be doing a video on New Year, actually, about what I want to achieve in 2022, so keep a lookout for that. Um, but yeah, that's that's pretty much everything I got for Christmas this year. Right, guys, that is going to be that for this video. I really hope you have enjoyed it. Um, if it went on a bit too long, you know, sorry, but I did have a lot of stuff to get through. I did say that. Um, I hope you have enjoyed the video. If you have, as always, make sure you drop a thumbs up and leave a like rating on the video. As I said, it helps push it way up the algorithm and makes the channel reach new audiences, which is always a, a good thing, always a good thing. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button as well. As I said, I've got a new video coming out, New Year, which outlines what I want to achieve in 2022, what I want to achieve next year. 
so yeah keep a lookout for that so as I said leave a like rating and subscribe if you haven't already uh, I hope you all have uh, an enjoyable safe rest of your Christmas day uh, or if you're watching this after Christmas I hope you did have a wonderful day and had a great time with your friends and family um, yeah thank you so much for watching guys have a safe and blessed Christmas and New Year. I will see you in about a week with a new video, uh, as I said, depending on when you're watching this. So, yeah, uh, have a great week, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you in the next video. Thank you very much for watching. Take care and peace.